What's up guys, welcome back again. Just want to show you guys one of the top free and paid launcher that you can really use. And it's been quite a long, I have done any launcher reviews. And if I say, if I just count here, so I have done more than dozens of launcher reviews. So you can check the uh, details in the my playlist or show my notes too, I will put that links below. And each time I go to any launcher, I review that, I use that couple of days or maybe weeks and depends on the how complex the launcher is. I used to give you guys demo all the pros and cons like in terms of everything. And then every time I used to come back to this Nova Launcher Prime. There is something in this launcher that always makes me to come back to this place. And a lot of apps and demos each week and month that I used to post for the Android for you guys. And I tried a lot of launchers and apps itself. Uh, there is almost something a common trend in each launcher. Whichever launcher you try, each launcher just try to give you, you know, uh, just flood your smartphone home screen. Uh, I don't know. I don't understand why each developer just thinks that uh, uh just give everything on your phone a home screen it gives the you know the gives the most of the launcher itself it's not always true uh in the true android fans if you're really true android fan then uh, you you do want to make your phone customized like i am doing as a for example as you can see this is nexus 6 running android marshmallow this is nexus 6p running android and developer preview 2 and couple of two desktop here all are in the same uh, wallpaper here and quite similar to you can get this wallpaper on my facebook page already is posted i will post that again so and uh, every time i try any launcher and uh, they have some unique features in each launcher for example all launchers give you a lot of widgets on that uh, mostly the common one is being you know the weather and all and couple of pages they all give a lot of animations in terms of folders and review they organize your home screen in the way they want not you want that's why i'm saying to make your phone personalized in the way you want it there the launcher should be which according to you can customize in your own way mm -hmm. so no launcher gives you all the flexibility and everything else that you wanted to try on your phone and it's really 100 percent customizable so i'm just going to give you guys a brief of how this nova launcher is and what is that all about because uh, i ended up in buying the pro version it's being six month continuous i'm using this launcher and occasionally i used to switch to google now launcher because some of the stuffs i need to try for the marshmallow and the uh, android and native stuff let me show you guys exactly as you can see we are using this nexus 6p to give you guys demo because i really like this nexus 6 because of this huge camera and all so let me tell you guys a couple of the features here the first feature you can see i will go inside this uh, app drawer first so as you can see guys then this is the only launcher that gives you the maximum of your app drawer as you can see we just go down here you can see uh, i can is uh, i'm totally able to use most of my screen you can see it's just going to down below and on the top too it goes to the maximum that you can get from any of the launcher most of the launchers uh, they don't give this options and apart from that you can totally customize the number of rows you want in that number of columns you want in there and you can customize all the stuff like whether you want play store a link here a direct place link is that you can easily go to there you don't need to carry extra play store icon you can see i don't have any play store icon i just come here and go there and that way it does there another feature it gives you guys here the recent number of apps you can customize that and this is sorted according to the you know alphabetical order you can say and now let's come to the desktop you can see here you can make this folder uh, in the way you want to organize here you can make it transparent let me go to the setting and show you guys here again this is what setting is here inside the folders you can see uh, you can uh, take the percentage of transparency you want which color you want so i have taken a uh, light of most of the transparent you can take the animation where it is circle or zoom how it comes like that also uh, folder preview you can take grid fan so whatever you want stack so you can see now it's changed to whatever you want and this is the only launcher which has right now the android and uh, this uh, developer preview feature that as you can see here right uh, this folder structure as you can just compare here uh, this is a native android and uh, icons that you will get here in this uh, and nova launcher prime so this is the only launcher as of now which gives you setting of this uh, android and preview folder so let me show you go to uh, settings and folder and if you see here you can see this is end preview this is android and developer preview if i just change it here so i am getting this android and by default stuffs so this is here and there is no uh, as such a screen set you can add as much number of screens you want and also the biggest advantage guys you can take the backup of the complete you know 
layout as i said guys i used to reset phones my most of the time because switching to android marshmallow then coming back to debut 2 and changing lot of themes here so i somehow get lost uh, all the stuff here i need to uh, do lot of again you know hard work and extra work again so simply you need to just take the backup and you can store the backup to cloud for example i use single backup file to come uh, to store all the app layout in my nexus 6p and the nexus 6 itself you can just go there and take backup it can give you option where you want to save if you just select it share it will give you option to you know store to one drive and where place you want or also you can store it locally so and also this is a complete night mode option and this is also android n feature you can see night mode is a follow system you can take always so this gives you default uh, android and theme for example this is the android marshmallow running and this is android and dev preview 2 so here you can say we just go to setting we'll get the option of this dark theme here like you can say always so everything here uh, search bar app drawer whatever is there it can change to complete dark so uh, that's why i said this is the only launcher which gives you most of the android and features and it's quite active uh, none of the launcher i have found that and uh, not more they are running in the beta then they come to final like the android and beta program it runs in beta and it tests the features first and then it gives you guys here and the paid version is not that much costly you will get a couple of the extra features and let me show you guys one of the other biggest advantages uh, i have here this phone here this is a uh, Micromask Canvas Spark 2 Plus and this is world's cheapest Android Marshmallow phone. This is the reason I bought that. Uh, somehow I really like stock stuff so and Android Marshmallow gives you much of the features like you can use uh, internal SD card as internal memory and you need to talk about this internal 4 gigs or 8 gigs of internal 12 gigs whatever you have. I can expand to 30 gigs of storage here. So by default uh, since this phone has very low PPA just 196 so uh, whenever I got here uh, I got this uh, folders here a lot bigger. Let me show you guys exactly here. Uh, if you go to the setting and just change the home so by default if you take any launcher you can see this is the default launcher when i uh, chosen that so it's a uh, slightly slower compared to this marshmallow and uh, this uh, so you can see the icons are really big uh, you know it takes a lot of space if you go to uh, home screen you can see folders are really big so only this uh, android uh, this uh, nova launcher prime gives you that flexibility you can really change your icon size and everything else so i just came here uh, again i selected and mo modified most of the stuffs and i come back here you can see uh, if you just go to uh, this uh, setting and this uh, uh, desktop and in each of the folder desktop after there is an option icon and layout you can really change the size which where you want icons you can see i can really increase the size here because most of the guys when i used to give weekly an app demo monthly app demo so a lot of people ask me uh, how you can customize how you made this you can see this is you know uh, double line now if you select single line it goes to single line if you select here it goes to again double line so many people have asked how do you customize a lot of stuff because all your app draws are background so this is the main reason again guys i want to show you guys this demo of this launcher why it's so unique uh, each time if i go to another launcher i used to come back here so we done a lot of customize the folder and you can add all the stuff which are widgets folder whatever you want you can add any number of screen you want and you can really feel itself this is nexus 6 one of the hugest canvas phone i love this phone most of the purpose nexus 6p i'm using for my camera purpose only otherwise i do most of the stuff here and you can see uh, is uh, even the background of this app drawer is almost transparent uh, you will get a lot of features here so it's slightly very good launcher guys so definitely in case you're looking for even the if you go to a paid version uh, the option that you will get extra you know just inside the folders uh, uh, if you try to organize your folder you will get uh, some extra features with the paid version because you can say uh, just if you want to just change the size and all you will get this paid otherwise uh, free version is works most of the times uh, i use earlier free version and somehow i really like that i just got an offer and ended up purchasing it within less than a dollar that's why i like that so there you go guys uh review was the, one of the best launcher that you can say uh, it's not like i haven't tried i tried all the most of the top launchers you can check out in previous video and if you really want to buy any launcher even if you don't want to buy you just want to stick to pay free version the, this free version of nova launcher itself is very powerful you can get that and check that and also guys don't forget to watch the my previously uploaded video in which i have shown you guys the top five camera apps and one of the best free cameras that you can really use and that's it guys uh, this is sort of behind the scene and i hope you enjoyed this video if i really helped you hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe to watch upcoming videos of weekly monthly and apps demos and a lot of android and tips and tricks marshall and all stuff so make sure to watch that if you have any concerns and queries let me know on my twitter handle either jsabot you can follow me to get the latest tweets and updates thank you very much for watching i will talk to you very soon have a nice day ahead